It is the first day of school for students in Clarksville, Indiana, and along with the new school year comes new turf for the athletic field. WHAS 11's Gabriel Gonzalez got a first-hand look at the progress and what this means for that district. Because of the turf, we don't have to cancel due to just rain showers. You could say it's a long time coming. Six years ago, our lights were still on the field here at football. A new state-of-the-art turf is being installed at Clarksville High School. The field currently looks like this, a field of gravel. Crews are working every day to have it complete for the first football game of the season on September 6th. Weather looks good. Contractors have been out here busy, as you can see today. Uh, so we're, we're expected a completion date here by the end of the month. Athletic Director Levi Carmichael says this new field is not just for the high schoolers, but other students in the district as well. The ability and adaptability uh, this field is going to allow us to do is to get all of our teams, all of our community events in one place, uh, where in the past we've had to worry about the natural grass and whether it could take the pounding of all those events going on at one time. Now this track right here is no more than one year old and it's part of a long list of upgrades that Superintendent Bennett told me these projects are for the students. And we're trying to just modernize and become you know a part of the 21st century if you will so uh, we understand that athletics is oftentimes the front door of a school and extracurriculars in general are. The baseball infield also seeing an upgrade to match the football field. Here's what it's expected to look like when it's complete later this year. The softball field next to Clarksville Middle School is next on the list. It's currently not in use. Here's what it's going to look like with that same turf design. It has an expected completion date later this year. That allows us again to play youth games, high school games, middle school games, all here on campus to where we don't have to go seek out other places to play um, because of rain or because of the grass being too wet. In Clarksville, Gabriel Gonzalez, WHAS 11, on your side. And the superintendent told us today she's confident these new projects will help their athletes compete at the next level. The first home football game, by the way, for Clarksville High School is coming up on September 6. Don't forget, we want to see your students in back to school. It's a big week, as already, we've already been telling you. Of course, JCPS coming up on Thursday. We like to put the smiling faces right here on the air. Text the photos to this number. Again, text only 502-582-7290. Don't forget the name of your student and where they're going to be heading to school. And we'll put those photographs right here on the air uh, next few weeks on our newscasts.